Hello, good morning to everyone. Welcome to Tech Easy. Today in this video, we'll see how you can fix if Bluetooth is not showing devices. See here. Right now, I just turned on the Bluetooth. I personally faced an issue while connecting this phone with the Bluetooth of my JBL speakers. See here, I'll show you my JBL speakers. Yeah, see here, this is the JBL speakers. So, see when I try to keep this JBL uh, speakers in the pairing mode and still when I'm unable to connect through it to Bluetooth pairing device, there are two troubleshooting steps you can do. The first thing is you need to open your phone settings, your Android phone settings then scroll down until you'll find apps here and click on see all the apps and now search for the bluetooth here so if you are unable to find any bluetooth devices then you need to click on these three dots at the top right then click on show system apps now try to find this bluetooth yeah now it is appeared here you need to click on the storage and clear the cache now do one thing restart your mobile and again turn on the bluetooth if it is disabled now when you turn on and make sure you are in the pairing mode of the other device it may be a phone or tv or any bluetooth device make the other device in the pairing mode then try to connect most probably in the 90 cases now after you clear the cache and restart of your mobile now this problem will be automatically get solved okay what you can do is delete some of the connected device okay actually this has worked for me and now disable this bluetooth once and re-enable it and now it checks for the available devices then your device will be visible here so that you can connect if this step didn't work for you you need to click on the phone settings again then uh, reach the system it will be somewhere at the bottom system then here you will find something like reset options and here you will find reset wi-fi mobile and bluetooth so what this reset will do uh, don't worry this won't reset your phone this is only resets wi-fi mobile data and bluetooth means if there are any previously connected wi-fi passwords means to your home wi-fi those will be cleared so you make sure double before uh, clicking on this reset settings because all your saved passwords of the wi-fi or uh, previously connected bluetooth devices everything will go off means cleared you need to manually enter your wi-fi password again and you need to connect so if you're double sure that then you can go for that option and now restart your mobile and try to check it in these cases either step one will work or step two will work please do comment which step worked for you yeah see here now this jbl cinema 240 has been connected now it is showing the name see here if you can hear the sound uh, the sound of the jbl speaker just now connected so now it has been connected jbl cinema sb240 this one has been connected see here so now i can play songs on this phone and that will be uh, coming audio output in the jbl speakers i hope you like this tutorial and thanks for watching have a nice day